What's good, YouTube? It's your boy DRIF A. Today, we're going to be reacting to 30 of the most shocking WWE face turns of all time. Make sure I go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Make sure I subscribe because your boy is almost at 4K. So, help your boy out because without y'all, I can't get there. So, help your boy out, please. I got a lot of videos on this channel and I'm sure I have something that you like. And I know this is not your first time watching one of my videos. It's not. It's not. I got over 500 videos. It's not your first time seeing me. Just subscribe, bro. Just subscribe. At this point, just subscribe. Hey, man, let me know what y'all want to react to next. But without further ado, let's get into this video. I thought Umaga was always a heel. Bro, I thought Umaga was always a heel. The shield always does what's best for business. I hit on the shield. The shield of Boyd Roberts. Spare my ranks. Oh, why did do that to Corporate Kane, bro? Uh, it's it's still it's still so weird to me to see Vince literally do everything. He he was an interviewer, as we can see right here. He was an interviewer. He was a commentator. He's in Gorilla. He was a wrestler at times. He won a Royal Rumble. He was a WWF champ. Vince did it all. Literally, he did it all. He did everything. He has literally done everything. And I think this was his way to show his guys that he hires like I if, if I know how to do it you should be able to do it <laughs> like something like that I don't know <laughs> I don't know man it's just crazy though the fact that he's the owner and he's doing all these different things that's crazy ain't no way he'd do it now though you know he ain't doing it now but back then that's crazy you're not totally heartless Razor Ramon I is you don't have a price <laughs> Family's ready to bring the fight to the new WWE. I forgot Randy ran with Bray Wyatt for a little bit. It's so weird. Oh wow! Luke Harper. It looks like it's looked like he's here to join John Cena. He's helping. Big Yo. He's berating Yokozuna, and rightfully. I'm curious why they gave Yokozuna a Japanese. Character because he's Samoan. So um, I, I just want to know why they gave him like a Japanese sumo wrestler type of character when he's literally Samoan. He's a part of the Samoan dynasty. Why did they give him that? I'm I really I'm really I'm curious. He's be he's berating Yokozuna and rightfully Karnat is just verbally raping Yokozuna. God, just. Oh my gosh! Bro, that's a big dude, bro. I can see that. I can, I can kind of see. I can kind of see the whole sumo thing, but not. Okay. Then I just be a Mark Henry. Kali? Seven, three, four hundred twenty pounds bigger. Hey! 
Oh! <laughs> he tried to mess with his head. Oh my gosh! No, 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 we going back. That got me hype, hold on. I missed this, bro. Oh my gosh. I have chills. I have chills. I missed this. Everybody in the crowd is screaming yes like that. That is literally like, that was literally like the money maker, bro. Everybody in the crowd. And I remember when he won at WrestleMania, what was it, WrestleMania 30? When he beat Batista and basically, I guess, Evolution without Ric Flair, of course. Or The Authority, I should say. When he fought The Authority. The crowd was crazy for that, too. <laughs> that Dan Bryan, yes, that is different. It's simple, but it's different. That's crazy. Put my hands on you. Oh. Rikishi, come on out here. You deserve better in the WWF than to be Vince McMahon's pawn. Rub him in his face. Oh. Rikishi just knocked down the commissioner. He running. Come on, can you see he wants to dance and play his music? Uh-oh. Make Foley about to dance? What are you? <laughs> what was that? This could be dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what was that? Make mix head off. I can't. Oh, this could be dangerous. <laughs> Tear mix head off. I can't tell. He's already here tonight. A sort of uh. Dang, I wish I had a show more. I want to see Mick Foley dance. Well, he's probably never coming back to WWE. Seth Rollins doesn't like him. I spin the face of people who don't want to be cool. To win the tag team titles, would you? You don't always stay on the same page throughout a match. Oh. Never wondered about them being on the same page. They lost as a team. They're not rocket scientists. simple thing sign the contract reach your dreams you know what you want to do big man don't you i've known what i was gonna do for a long time get that championship off your shoulder i ain't gonna lie triple h put a lot of people over if you think about it if you really think about it like, all the people that Triple H has helped, like, get over, over that hump, just think about it. Like, Randy, Batista, and then we got all the young guys now. Like, there's a lot of people. Like, it's too many to even name. Triple H helped a lot of people out in the, in the business, bro. It's crazy. I wonder, like, if Triple H never became, like, if Triple H was never a wrestler, how would these people that he's helped, how would they have turned out without Triple H? That's interesting. You will. Be 
an Olympic gold medalist. Oh, Virgil just failed. The million dollar man by accident. He rocked him too. I can't even tell who is who. It's so blurry. All I saw was Dusty and Ted DiBiase. Oh! I go. I was waiting for him to call my boy. Well, we see uh, Eric Rowan make a return to WWE since Bray Wyatt is back. Will he come back too? R.I.P. Brody Lee, by the way. But will Rowan come back? I remember this. Samoa. Samoa Joe. Stop. Oh. Samoa Joe is back. If it wasn't for you, I would be W. Bro, when I was younger, am I the only one that thought they were brothers? Are they really brothers in real life? Could they look alike? Alex Riley and the Miz look alike, bro. Y'all can't tell me they don't look like they could be brothers in real life if they're not. I think they're really brothers. Like they look like they're brothers or or cousins or something, bro. They got they related some kind of way. I don't care. They have almost the same face. And when I was when I was watching, what was it? You remember when NXT in the beginning where they had basically a superstar, and then they had somebody that uh, basically an NXT superstar and their mentor, which is the main roster star, and it was these two. And I thought they were like brothers. Like they look like they could be. WWE champion wasn't like I was the one who said I quit. Say, what is she say? Get him! Oh! Look at this! The Miz put a lot of people over too. If you think about it, he still is putting people over. Wait, wait, what is this? It's not that old because look at the, the logos. This isn't that old. What is this? That was that might have been the worst sell I've ever seen in my life. What was that? Look at look at how he sold this. Look how he sold this. Let me look at this one more time. Man was moving like somebody threw water on him or something. And it needs to be done. So that means one and oh. mm. This is recent. This is very recent. This is very recent. Mason Ryan. 
Y'all think that's the end of the Usos? Or is it just the end of Sami Zayn with the bloodline? Is it the end of the Usos too? Because he walked out on... We're going to find out today, actually. Because today's Friday. So, your boy is going to be watching SmackDown. We're definitely going to find out today. But, um, what do y'all think? Let me know in the comments. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I hear Booker. Listen to Booker. Woo, woo, woo. Kind of look like Dominic stole his whole drip. Apparently, there's rumors that uh, the Guerrero family is not happy that Dominic is basically stealing Eddie's gimmick, which he kind of is, but he's kind of not at the same time. I think Dominic is doing really good. Dominic has become a better performer in ring, and he's getting better as a talker. He's getting better. Dominic is definitely getting better. I think he's a pretty good heel so far. At first, you know, once once he did the, you know, edge kick thing, I was like, okay, Dominic has a chance to be a really good heel. He's been, I think he's been doing pretty good. I don't think he's been doing terrible. He's not the worst heel I've ever seen, but he's not also, he's also not the best. But if he's getting people to boo him, that means he's doing something right. So I think Dominic's doing pretty good. <laughs> the team member that I he say, oh God. To wrestle next week in a steel cage, you. Paul Heyman. <laughs> oh my God. As Vince McMahon. Oh no, that's Stone Cold song trash. Well, let me know how y'all feel about that video. If y'all like videos like this, make sure y'all go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like I said, man, because I got a lot of videos like this. So uh, let me know what y'all want to react to next. But hey, man, like the video, subscribe if you're new. It's your boy, D-River, man. I'm out.